In the heart of Alberta, the Gambia lived a determined and ambitious young man named Pa. He had always wanted to work for himself. Growing up, his father wanted him to become a teacher, but he chose hotel catering and hospitality. After completing senior secondary education, he pursued his diploma certificate in the field of hotel catering. Upon graduation and working for a few hotels, he later left the Gambia for greener pasture in the United Kingdom. He is now investing all his earnings into agriculture in his home country, the Gambia, as he plans his repatriation back to the motherland. Pa is my son. He's the eldest now. He has only one elder brother. I think it's Manjai Diba. Mm -hmm. He's second to Manjai. And uh, he, uh, he went to school here, mm -hmm. went to high school. You see, I'd, I wanted him to become a teacher. He was so interested so much, he started teaching for some time in my own school when I was principal here in Alberta. Okay. Then he left Alberta to join the hotel industry. He had his two-year training course finished and then was employed in the hotel industry. And he did very well. He fared very well mm -hmm. until he had his way to uh, UK. UK. And he has, he has now got his citizenship. Uh, he comes down on holidays. Mm -hmm. And uh, he is doing very well. So the brothers are also emulating him. Yeah. You see, if he can have this, almost uh, 180 by 180 with 300 trees. Yeah. And you see, castle farming now yeah. has gained weight. Gained weight, yeah, of course. You see, yeah. all that you need to do is make sure that the fence is properly cleared inside. Yeah. And then you have your fruit inside. Inside, yeah. If they are ripe, you just come and pick. You can pick uh, one whole bag a day. A day? A day. You can pick... A 50 kilogram bag a day if wow. you come if you come with your family i see that can give you almost 15 to 16 thousand dollars you see just yeah. that bag just one bag just one bag so yes. every day you score sixty thousand dollars in three 16, months 16 thousand 20 thousand at times ten thousand minimum that children can pick here because the uh, the one kilo team it's almost 150 at times 75 if it is if, if, if the price depreciates. Oh. So how much money will you get if you have four kids? Four kids. Yeah. Okay, that's that's almost 300 dollars. 300 dollars is yeah. You see, if the tomato team mm -hmm. is 75 or is 100, if you pick it's, four, it's, it's 400. If you pick five, yeah. it's 500 per in, day. In combos, is um is like um 150. Good. Yeah. You see, so how many of those pops can you pick from 300 trees? Um, it will be no, like... No, you cannot quantify it here. <laughs> <laughs> you cannot quantify that. Yeah, definitely. It all depends on how you nurse them. Yeah. And then, you see, and also depending on the rainfall. On the rainfall. So, you see, so this is also another form of uh, farming. Yeah. You see, you don't need to fall down the trees again. You only ought to nurse them, make sure the inside is clean mm -hmm. to prevent firebush. Firebush. You see. Mm -hmm. So if you belt it properly about three meters away, you can save this land with trees, fruiting for the next 10, 15 years. Or less if you don't want uh, cashew nuts again. Yeah, of course. Okay? Yeah. So, you see, it is a very good in, um, uh, I mean investment. Yeah. And, uh, you see, you don't have anything to lose. To lose. If you don't want them again, mm -hmm. you can remove all of them and burn them to charcoal. And you can have hundreds and hundreds of, of, of bags of charcoal which you can sell and start fencing or start start an other project. Other project. This is so so um, very profitable. somebody or someone might be interested um, like, um, to buy a land in here and then um, to start um, um, castle farming. Of, so, of course. So of are course. you ready for that? Yeah, that, that was what he did. Yeah. And now he has trees. Trees, yeah. Okay, so mm -hmm. we, we have empty land. Mm -hmm. So I, I, I see, and it's good advice. Yeah. And it is sustainable, sustainable. quite sustainable. Yeah. You see, land does not depreciate, it appreciates. If you have 200 meters by 200 meters, mm -hmm. and then you decide to go into castle farm, mm -hmm. into castle farming, all that you need to do is fence it mm -hmm. with barbed wire, mm -hmm. just about three rows, and then with 500 sticks or 1,000 sticks, you can you can fence your area. And you start sowing your, your mm -hmm. castle nut. And then next year, by this time, they will all have you know, I mean, germinated and grown up. Yeah. And you start clearing inside. Within two years, you start 
reaping your benefit. The benefit, yes. You see, so this is an otherwise way mm -hmm. of venturing into farming. Into farming. Yes. You see, you can you can do a lot in the farm as well. Mm -hmm. Before they grow to this level, you can you can plant groundnuts, mm -hmm. you can sow groundnuts, you can sow findi, you can sow beans, you see, you can sow coos, coos. and you still harvest alongside as they grow. As they grow. So it can take you three to four years to be using the same land where you have planted these the cassos, cassos, yeah. <laughs> and yet still you are in your own yard. Yes. You know, reaping mm. other benefits uh, yeah. uh, because you have... Before starting harvesting the, the cassos. Multi-cropping. Yeah, multi-cropping. You can yeah. use it for multi <laughs> So that, that is why I am interested yeah. to bring you here mm. so that you can also sell this idea. Idea. This is vast land. Vast land. So you can see this. You see, vast land. And if any, if anybody is interested in casu farming, you can contact Sally and Family Foundation. We can, we can, we can do a lot of things together. Together, we are here for everybody. Sure. That is why I am prepared to sell as much as possible what I have ventured into uh, um, poultry and farming. Uh, 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 I mean activities. activities so yeah. this is a great example mm -hmm. and in the UK mm -hmm. the farmers are the richest the richest in the UK in the UK <laughs> in America the farmers are, are the richest okay they are not now, comparable it is, to anybody it is possible like a non um, a non um, British to have um, his own land in and why not why not you it, have people here mm -hmm. who have associates mm -hmm. family members mm -hmm. friends you see very reliable, and they have bought land here. Land, land. Yes, okay. of course. Okay, like um, people who are um, who are in combos, um, they need a joining hand. Like um, for you to join them in their land in combos, are you ready for that? Like to why, invest? Why not? Why not? Yeah. We are experienced farmers, as yeah. I said. Yeah. Okay. This is my place. Mm -hmm. This is where what we can do, mm -hmm. and uh, you see, experience is the best teacher. It's the best teacher. You see, we have done what we are supposed to do as civil servants. We have left the service, we are retired. But you see what experience has done. You see, that is why we will never regret why we have been to school, why we have traveled, why we have made a lot of association with people at, 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 at different places yeah. around the world. Around the so world. today, if anybody wants to, to venture into farming, I am a typical example. Yeah, I have of worked course. with uh, you see ITC. Yeah. You see, you see, I have a credible uh, mm -hmm. sort of uh, 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 I mean foundation, foundation. and family yeah. have no foundation, a charitable one, mm -hmm. a registered one, mm -hmm. an organized one, quite a, I mean a credible one. Yeah. That is why ITC has has decided mm -hmm. to use um, uh, the center, you know, as a training, um, you see, a sort of. Uh, ground as a trading place for, for anybody who wants to do poultry farming. Yeah, okay. We have got that contract with ITC. ITC. And I, have, so I am sure yeah. we have gone through a lot of a lot of chat, a lot of visits before we reach that level. Levels. And today we have worked with ITC. ITC. That can convince anybody yeah. in Europe, in the diaspora, anywhere to say, you see Sally and Family Foundation in Alvreda yeah. is a credible organization. It's a credible organization. And that people yeah. can rely on it mm -hmm. to, 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 to start up yeah, agriculture. To start up programs yeah. in farming. Yeah. And we can also train. Train. Yeah. I am an educationist. Yes. I can train. I've yeah. got my staff who are trained. Who are trained. You see, mm -hmm. by, 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 by some, 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 some other UN personnel mm -hmm. in poultry farming and management. So and, you, are, you, and, and you, you have a joint business with UN? Good, of course, of course. That's the ITC. If, uh, I, can, okay. if, if I have contract with the ITC mm -hmm. to train students, yeah. you see, in my project, yeah. and then certificate them, mm -hmm. and then give them a handsome reward as a start of capital, and they have started, and they have succeeded. Succeeded. That is credibility. Yeah. That can tell anybody that if you want to venture into farming, yeah. in different forms of farming, you can contact Sally and Family Foundation, yeah. Yeah. because we are here for everybody yeah. and uh, that is why now we are a credible sort of foundation and that, that, that is why UN has trusted us to train students here and work according to you see their expectations 
and we have satisfied them and those people have graduated and they are now working on their own and we are supervising them. I am supervising them to make sure that there is no failure mm -hmm. from anywhere at all at and they are all progressing. Okay. You see, so I think this is food for thought. Yeah, food for thought. Yeah. <laughs> it is food for thought. Yes. <laughs> so you can see me. Yeah. And you, 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 you must know that this man has got the experience. Yeah, of course. And he has, of course, you know, some other people who are experts in what I am doing. What you are doing, yeah. Okay. So um, my people, I'm um, right here. I'm here. I'm forward. That's uh, me, myself, lucky child. So I'm um, here. Is the dad himself, Mr. Tiba. I'm um, contact him to start up agriculture. Um, or if you don't have an idea about agriculture, just contact him. Talk to him live and direct. Um, he will show you ways. He will. Um, in case also, if you need a joining business or you want um, for him to um, train your kids or your family members, um, dial him's number. Talk to him live and direct. Um, he is full of experience. So stay tuned, subscribe, like it, and share it.